can you save the American eel? Known as Pimisi in Anishinaabemowin, this fascinating and mysterious species was plentiful in the Ottawa River only a few generations ago. The eels that came to our watershed were all female and were some of the largest and strongest in the world. This made them incredibly important for the entire species. But in the last 40 years, the population of eels in our watershed has collapsed by 99% and it is now listed as threatened by Kozawik. What happened? Adult eels made and spawn in the Sargasso Sea, located in the Atlantic Ocean. Juvenile eels must make the long journey back upstream to grow within the river systems of the Americas. The Ottawa River watershed is one of the furthest ranges to which these eels travel, so only the strongest make it. But over the past several decades, something changed. The Carillon Dam, which was completed in 1962 and located just upstream of the mouth of the Ottawa River, has prevented the eel from returning to its freshwater habitat. The same is true for other dams across North America, making them the single greatest obstacle to eel migration. Some dams have specially designed installations known as eel ladders that allow for passage upstream. The Carillon Dam does not. Hydro-Québec, which owns and operates the Carillon Dam, recently announced a $750 million project to retrofit and upgrade the infrastructure of the dam. But that plan does not include the installation of an eel ladder to help restore this threatened species. We need your help. Write to your MPP and ask that they mandate the construction of an eel ladder at Carillon. This could be our best and only chance to save this essential species. Act now.